So I have Josh pinned down, and we're both making eye contact with each other for, like, what felt like a long time for me, but really it was, like, a second or two. And I realized that if I wanted to make a move, this was my chance. So I just leaned in and kissed him. Josh kissed me back for, like, a second, and then pushed me off of him. He was like, what the hell, dude? Are you gay? I was literally panicking at this point. Like, I felt like I just got caught, like, outed. So I tried to play it off, and I was like, no, I'm not gay. Like, I was just fooling around. We talked about this for a second, and Josh was not buying it. Like, he didn't believe that I was straight anymore. So I leveled with him, and I told him, like, I'm mainly into girls, but I can get excited about guys sometimes, too. And then to my surprise, Josh was actually really cool about that. And he was, like, just talking to me about it casually. And then he started asking me, like, what specifically I like about guys. And he wanted to know, like, what would I want to do with a guy? So I told him, and I told him, like, you know, if I was with another guy, I just would want to get, like, handsy or something. And then really, to my surprise, Josh just says I can go ahead and do that to him if I want to. I was honestly confused by this at first. And he was like, yeah, man, no big deal. Like, it's just a hand. I don't care. And of course, I wasn't going to pass up this opportunity. So I was like, okay, down. Sounds great. But I really couldn't figure out if Josh was just, like, actually letting me do this. Or if he was, like, also into guys and this was just his way of um, making it so he could still claim he was straight. I kind of assumed it was the latter, and in the moment, I didn't really care either way. I was just down to be able to do something with another guy. So I agreed, and Josh made me promise that I wouldn't tell anybody ever. So, you didn't hear this. And then Josh took off his boxers and laid back on the bed, and he, like, he just, like, laid there and, like, closed his eyes. Like, just, I guess, just waiting for me to do what I needed to do. And I don't think I can go into too many more details about that without violating guidelines, but let's just say, like, oh my god, we had a good time. And Josh seemed really, really into it. Like, more than a straight guy should be into doing anything with another guy. Like, he literally lasted, like, less than two minutes. So the next day I brought him up and I told him I had a really good time. He told me that it was, like, fine. And then he again reiterated that I better not tell any of the other guys. So we just went on with our day and didn't say anything. And then back in school, he was treating me pretty much the same as he did before. Like, he was joking around with me, he was being really nice, but every time I tried to, like, actually hit on him, because I did try, he would shoot me down. But we were never in, like, a one-on-one -on -one setting, like, at night, like we were when we would spend the night together at these tournaments. Like, Josh shouldn't do sleepovers or anything, but I kind of figured, like, maybe the next time we go on a tournament, something will happen again. So maybe I'll tell you guys a story about the other tournaments in the future, but for now, we're going to leave it at that. If you like my stories, hit follow. There's more to come. I have way too many stories.